So today we are going to be sharing with you guys a little bit about our love story. So a lot of you guys have been commenting and asking us if we're married, where did we meet, how long have we been together, like everything. So we thought it'd be cool to share from the beginning and I'm kind of curious to see how you remember it. <laughs> so I'll she, see how much I remember. <laughs> yeah, so, so she's gonna do a lot of the talking. And then while I'm telling the story, we are gonna be making the dogs um, some pumpkin treats. Also, we're gonna link the recipe down in the description so if you guys want want to check out what we're making. It's just basic pumpkin treats. Okay, so like Kenny said, you guys have been asking us a lot of questions. Are we married? No, we're not married. Um, how not long? Yet. Not, <laughs> not yet. Not yet. <laughs> One day. How long have we been together? We're going on seven years now. Where did we meet? So that takes us back to the beginning of our story. Where did our we meet? Our story together. <laughs> what? <laughs> so we met in seventh grade in science class. And correct. <laughs> <laughs> I was very nervous because I was all of my friends went to a different school So I was the new girl in the school and I didn't know anybody so I was very nervous and I thought Kenny was really cute But one of my friends that I made on the first day of school said that he already liked her and kind of claimed him So from that point on I was, was, that, just that, like, was, was that a lie though? It was a lie, right? Or I was thought it? it was the truth but I, when I told Kenny that, it was like a couple years ago, I told him that, and he said it was a lie. Everything I mean, she I'm, told yeah, me. Yeah, I mean, I, maybe I thought she was like cute, but yeah. I didn't like, like, like yeah, or anything. Yeah, the way she made it sound to me. So I guess everything works, works out for a reason. Yeah. <laughs> so we had science class together in seventh grade, and from seventh grade all the way to when we graduated high school, we kind of always had a class together, and in high school, we kind of started becoming best friends to where we'd see each other in class and we'd always like pick seats next to each other or... Um... I, I don't know if you'd ever did, but I always was trying to get at least one class with you. Yeah. <laughs> even, through, even through like, so middle school was kind of lucky and then high school was when I was trying to be like strategic, like, hey, Rye, like what are what kind of classes are you taking? And, and then I would try I was and... not like that. No? I always thought it was just luck that and I, I did think in my head, I was like, well, hopefully I have a class with Kenny because that's just kind of how we were. We're best friends. But yeah. I never wanted to like make it. I, don't I always just I always just made sure because like Rye was like always the only person I could ever tell everything to. So I just always wanted to have a class with her so I could always just have that time to have somebody to go yeah. talk to. Because we didn't go to lunch all the time, but we would go to the lunch, go to lunch at least like maybe once a month, once every yeah. couple of weeks. Something like that. So middle school, beginning friends, high school, starting can, to become yeah. best friends. I would say like sophomore year was like when we started to really become like best friends, mm -hmm. tell each other everything. And then junior year, like best friends and then senior year. So senior year is when we kind of like started hanging out outside of school all the time, the end of senior year. And then it was... Well, so it was kind of like your senior year is when you're like deciding kind of like your future, right? Like you're deciding where are you gonna go to college? Where are you gonna work? Where you, like, what do you wanna do with your life in a sense? And Rye was... I played competitive wanted... softball. Yeah. And I wanted to go to college and play softball. Yeah. So at that time I was like taking trips and like visiting all these schools outside of the state. And so that to me was like, I was like, man, if, if I, not, not that I didn't want to keep Rai from not doing that. Cause we always talked about it and I always told her like, you know, you need to do what you want to do. Mm -hmm. And so Rai was thinking of going to play college. And so I just kind of wanted to tell her finally that I was like, Rai, like I really can't live without you type of thing. And I was like, you know, <laughs> Yes. I need you to stay, stay back with me. <laughs> <Please>. <laughs> so, which is really funny to me looking back on because during high school, before everything, before we really became best friends, I liked Kenny so much and I didn't ever want to say it to him, but I was more like if things happen, they happen and and I wanted to go to this dance with him. And so I was like now's my chance. I'll say like he didn't have a date yet. So I was like I'll just like hint like, hey, maybe take me to the dance. And so we were in class, I think in math <laughs> class or something. And, I, and he was talking about how he needed a date. And I was like, oh, why don't you take me? And he was like, mm, no. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, 
oh well why not <laughs> yeah like, there was a lot of <laughs> there was a lot of like mixed things going on and yeah. we were like not sure if we should be together or yeah. if it would be like but for me that was a turning point because it was like he put me in the friend zone so from that point on i kind of i never overstepped that boundary i was like we're friends he just wants to be friends now if we're back to senior year yeah that was kind of when we decided to, to be together it was spring break that we decided to actually make it official yeah and then so we went to prom together put some pictures reminisce <laughs> it was like the week before we graduated high school we saw these dogs for sale and we're like oh we'll just go look at them they'll be cute you know play with them whatever so we went and looked at them and we were like ah oh, no going back and forth but we wanted her so bad and of course we got her <laughs> So we had was, to have her. Yep, yeah, it was the day before graduation. It's we just, it's one of the, Sky. yeah, it's one of those yeah. things that's just like, because Sky really kind of started it all, I feel like, for us. I mean, yeah. like, I know we were, you know, we had a whole pass and everything, but like with Sky, like, it kind of like solidified that we're our like future, yeah, our like future our future together. is like together. Yeah. And there's just something about Sky that, that made me like have to have her in a sense. And, and then, yeah, then that's yeah. like after that, it's pretty much just, Right, fairy tale. Yep. <laughs> no, we've just we've after that it was just you went to college. Yep, I went to then, college here in our hometown. Yep, and then uh, about I ended up, two years into that, we bought a house and then we moved in together and then we started YouTube a few yep. years or a like year a year after. after that or two years after that. Yeah. And then we got Kakoa. Yep, we got Kakoa like almost right after we started YouTube. Yeah. Like a couple months after. Hi, right, Kiko. <laughs> And then now yeah. we're here and we've been together for six and a half, six years. And a half years and we we've have a lot plans. of goals and like things yeah. we want to accomplish and then obviously starting a family, getting married, all that kind of stuff is within those goals as yeah. well. So. But it started with these two little love bugs. <laughs> yeah, they're waiting for their treats so we should start actually making yeah. treats. <laughs> Are you ready for cookies? All right, we just got them out of the oven. Nice and warm, not too hot, just nice and warm. And one for cocoa. What do you guys think? I think they gave it A plus. Good job, Brad. <laughs> All right, guys, thanks for watching.